What the frick was it? What was it? What was it? I don't know what happened. What happened? Ooh. Hello and welcome to Creepy Couch. I'm Mary. And I'm Chad. Tonight we are going to watch what Sinister. It looks pretty scary. What's that say? <laughs> I don't have my readers on. An undeniably scary movie. We can't deny the scare. Let's just get into it. All right, let's go. Sinister. Um. Oh boy. What? What? BH Productions. You know what that stands for. Oh, the dreaded Blumhouse. You know, not everything that Blumhouse does is garbage. Maybe this will be one of a few. This looks like a crazy bumper sticker, huh? That would go on the back of someone's... Whoa. What the frick is going on? That's demented, man. Oh, darn. What in the world? Oh, man. I don't know, but um, that's so scary. Oh, boy. What are we doing here? What the heck is that? I don't know, was somebody up in the tree cutting that thing? What a one of those big branch cutters. Yeah. yeah. What an opener. Wow. Oh, I dig that house. I love ranch style homes. As long as they're long enough to get away from each other. Ethan Hawk. Dig that sweater. I got a sweater like that, don't I? Kinda, yeah. It doesn't have the cool patches. writer's patches. So, is this a haunted house movie? Are they moving into a haunted house, I guess? Yeah. Mm -hmm. like, in this next crime novel, an autograph? I just thought... That Are we... you kidding me? Oh, so du dude's a writer and... Oh, yeah. Well, hence the patches. Is it even legal to wear a sweater like that if you're not a writer? I think it's against the rules. Ashley? Honey? So he's a crime writer? That that looked like a crime book. I had to move here. The new story I'm writing is here. Why can't you just keep writing in the old house? Because I was going to have to write college textbooks to pay for that old house. Writers got to write what they got to write. Sometimes they don't have a choice. If we don't like it here, once I sell my book, we'll move back. So he's there for what? Research? Yeah, it seems like it. You just move around whenever you... We'll stay here for a year and... I guess, but... He clearly wasn't making enough money to support the household he had. I mean, that's a pretty big house. It must have been bigger than that. Just a friendly visit. I appreciate that, Ellison Oswald. I know who you are. Rude. Say you're not a fan. No. Well, what can I do for you? Well, not much, I expect, unless I can convince you to load those boxes back on that truck and leave as soon as you're able. What kind of writer is he? Right? You don't seem to care much for our profession. Not everybody in your profession gets it right. Well, I've read your books, neither do you. Your bad theory helped to kill or go free. You ruin people's lives. Now, this town doesn't need that. So he writes nonfiction? Yeah. And it sounds like he does cases that are still open or cold cases. Mm -hmm. Trying to get to the bottom of it. This is just another waste of your time, like your last two books. If writing true crime has taught me one thing, true except crime. whenever an office of the law tells me that I'm wasting my time, it just means he thinks he's wasting his. Shut down. I am going to go out on a limb and assume your department is not at my disposal. Well, what do you know? You can still get things right on occasion. That sucks. I find this to be an extremely bad taste. What? I don't know. What was all that about? He wanted an autograph, but he left his copy at home. Why was he pointing at the house? Didn't move in a few houses down from a crime scene again, did we? Oh, she doesn't know why he moved there. If we did, I don't want to know about it. We didn't. Promise? I promise. He's keeping it secret. Hmm. That's why he didn't tell her what that cop really wanted. I just, uh, when couples have weird secrets like that, it just doesn't make any sense to me. No, man. It's like, how do you, how do you stay married? Mm -hmm. Dang, window. That's the tree. Oh, sure is. I think he knows it. And that's why the cop said that. That's why it's in mm -hmm. poor taste. Yeah, kill Ooh, that man, that's another reason not to want to live there. Scorpion? Yeah. Oh, he's going to find secrets in there. you got to be kidding me. Oh. Family hanging out, 11. Oh, reel to reel. 
in the 70s. No, we haven't sold the old house yet. Once it's gone, we'll be able to afford a few extra things. That broken branch, they would have removed that, don't you think? The branch that was used to actually hang the family? Yeah, they'd have probably cut that whole tree down. Yeah, they for sure would have. Yeah, it's good. Of course it is. Will you take me and show me where it happened? Get a haircut, dude. Do you think it'd be easier for that kid to have his long hair and look cool like that or to have like a normal haircut and fit in? Like as far as how he would be treated. And, and it depends on what the rest of the school is like. The chicks would dig it. So that's really all that matters. I sure do. Kentucky blood was 10 years ago. What if that was your 15 minutes? It's a scary thought to think that you won't sell any more books past the past your last book. That's all. Oh my God, I really like a feeling about good. this. I really do. She might know like what he's doing, but not that they live in the house. So that chick is missing, that little girl? Man, that would just be creepy to live in the house and then get like into every aspect of the case, staying up late at night, writing about it all. Ew. Oh, this is gonna be sad, watching this family have fun together. So there's there's three kids. Yeah. Oh my goodness. That's on the film? Yeah. Someone just spliced that in there? Oh, yep. See, it's cutting. The branch is being cut. Oh, I see that. They're in the tree. Behind it. How creepy. You know, that would be hard to watch, but you know that dude's like, I hit the gold mine. But, I mean, how how rough. You know what I mean, though? He's like, I mean, he went there to write a book, and he's got these tapes now. Yeah. Or these uh, reels. So, I'm wondering if this house is going to be haunted by the chick, the missing girl. What if Stephanie's the one behind the tree? That'd be a tough job for her to do with that. Yeah, she's a kid. Did he hear something? Did he see something? I don't know. I think he heard something. One of his kids must be awake. It's too early in the film for this to be... Yeah. Daddy, I can't find the bathroom. Oh, I know that feeling, man. Growing up in the army, living so many different places, waking up, feeling the walls for the door to my bedroom. Are you going to write a really good book this time? So we can go home? So we can go home. What did they like, take their house to the pawn shop and they're just gonna buy it back? <laughs> Definitely the 70s. <laughs> hmm? <laughs> oh. Gosh. Gas tanks back there. Oh, I know. So this isn't that same family though, right? Or is that, it? No, this is, no. I mean, that was just having the cookout. Yeah, it's that family. It's not the first family though. Yeah. Oh man, what? Wow, what kind of snuff film yeah, is he I was, watching? I was going to say, this guy just has a stack full of snuff films. Mm. So what this is showing is that this is, these murders have this been going serial killer. on. Yeah. Dude, Why wouldn't... Go, sorry. Why wouldn't you go right to the cops? I was just going to say, dude needs to go to the cops. Oh, right? Yeah, you can't, like, withhold this information. But on the other hand, his whole family's relying on to, to to write the big hit. And he's got stuff nobody else has. Operator. Oh, yeah. King County Police, please. Oh, okay. King County Police Department, how may I direct your call? King County Police Department, how may I direct your call? See, he's thinking what I was just thinking this is his ticket if he handles this himself and he releases a book that has all this i mean i don't know what the legalities behind that are if they find out he moved in this house they found the stuff that's evidence you came back and left the box why 66 oh boy yeah man every time i put one of those on yeah better pour that stiff drink buddy because 
So what did he hear? Did he hear something? Yeah, he thought that his daughter's music was on or something. Oh, it was music. I can't tell because Coda is in the shower with, with music. music on. Oh. I don't like that dark blue. Me neither, man. Too dark. That's a really wide hallway. Yeah, it is. Like exceptionally wide. How yeah, it's more like a hospital hallway. Yes. <laughs> what? Did that box move? No. I think he's just noticed that it's there. I know, but I swore it just moved. Which means somebody came in his house and put that there. Right. Yeah, see, oh, it just moved. It. Oh, there, what you do wider, buddy. <laughs> okay, Manson. Wounds <laughs> kebabs right for Get for Frannis. What is he doing? Night terrors in a box? Hey, wake up, all right? Hey, 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 wake up. Come on, come on, come on, wake up. Why are they taking him outside? Fresh air, maybe. Uh... Hey, look at the stars. Trevor, Trevor, Trevor. Ooh, dude, don't fall asleep in class at school because you'll be known as... They'll, they'll come up with something for you. Poor kid. Found him in one of the, one of the moving boxes. Oh, baby. That dude peed his pants, I'm sure. That was creepy. Yeah, I was still trying to recover from that. Come on, you heard your mother. Grab some road breakfast and skedaddle. Oh, look at that kid just yeah. throwing all the bacon on a piece of toast. He's making a bee. Just a bee. Just a bee. Grabbing the best of the best right there. Oh, man. Is this 66? I don't know. Probably. Oh, it's the one that he wound up and then turned off. What's that? What was that? Oh, one of the me. chairs. Oh, what's that? What's that? It's just at night. Oh, everybody's duct taped to the chairs. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Why is this person doing this? Oh, there's cinder blocks underneath there. I didn't see that. What is that? Is that underwater? Dude's gonna need therapy. I need therapy. <laughs> yeah, what is that? That's gotta be under the water. Is that like a mask? It looks like a mask because I think I see skin like here, you know. Oh, he paused it for too long. Oh, no. Oh, dude. He's going to need to get those on his hard drive. Oh, it's spliced, so he lost that whole yeah. footage. He lost the footage of the thing under the water. Yeah. yeah. Well, you got some other movies to go through, bro, so maybe it'll pop up. So the person filming it is... Someone the, different. So that's not the thing doing it. Right. Somebody is filming it. Moms will react. Your son is acting out again. He drew a picture with a permanent marker on the classroom whiteboard. Oh. Tell him yeah. what you drew. I drew a tree. With four people hanging from it. Oh, you better go talk to your boy and see uh, where he got that idea from. Don't do that. What? You didn't even blink. I probably blinked. Oh, little chihuahua. Yeah. Oh, and tied up people. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh, he sliced their throat. Oh my. Oh, jeez. Gosh. Oh. My gosh, this is. Brutal! Oh my gosh, man. So this guy's going after like whole families. Oh boy. Yeah, dude can't watch. 
He's not even using the glass anymore. He's just down in the bottle. No. Man, oh man. Something about that them being tied up and the tape over their mouth. That's what's doing it. Like they don't have any chance. They have to sit there and watch yeah. what's about to happen to them. They have no chance of fighting back. Hey, wasn't that symbol on the hood of the car was in the garage that got caught on fire or that was set oh, on fire? Oh, I don't know. I, I missed I that. I think so. <laughs> oh! Punch you in the face! You declared war. Yeah. Science, Science for, for kids. kids, St. Louis. St. Louis. Sleepy time, 98. Son's still missing. So there's like children missing from each family being murdered? Oh, man. Along with their younger son were found stabbed inside their home. And okay, I thought that all these murders happened in this house. No. Oh, well, that changes it up a little bit yeah. for me. Oh, okay. I'm assuming the last ones that took place took place in that house, and then dude came back and put all oh, those yeah. reels in there. Uh, Power just go out? Wouldn't you go find the source of the 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 reason why your power went out, you know? Yeah. I mean, that's the first thing I would do is go for that. Well, he probably is, just slowly, though, because he's creeped out. Yeah. Can't blame him, that's for like, sure. Like, he thinks that that dude, the serial killer, came back into his house before he moved in and put those there. And put his kid in a box. And who's to say, huh? Put his kid in that box. Oh. He might not even know where the fuse box is. He better freaking know where the fuse box is. What was that? I don't know. Pounding? Dude. I would go check my son first to make sure it's not him. <laughs> Creeping around. I would check on all my family. Heck yeah. First thing. It's in that attic, man. If that were you, mm -hmm. you would have come and got me. There is no way that you would be doing this on your own. Yeah, probably not. I don't. There's no sense in it. It just goes back to the secrets, holding secrets. It's like, no, man. Yeah, I mean, if something's going down, wouldn't you want to know? It's like, hey, give me a hand. Grab yeah, a knife. two people are better than one. Yeah, grab a knife. Let's see what. I'll yeah. get the bat. You get the knife. Whatever. Yeah. <laughs> Oof. Check, make sure my kid's not in here. <laughs> what? 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 Did that just move? Yeah, is what? this kid inside that? What was that? It's probably a scorpion underneath there. Yeah, it looks like a box lid or something. Yeah. Oh, a oh, snake. A snake. Red next to yellow could kill a fellow. What's that? What's that? Family. Mr. Boogie. Dude, just take that with you. Those are the people in the pool. Party. Mr. Boogie. So Mr. Boogie was the thing under the water. There's the car on fire. Sleepy time. What was the next one? Them? Oh, I don't know. Them? Whoa, dude! Yeah, just drop. I was gonna say, you're better off to just drop, but why? What just yeah. happened? He, he fell through the door, the attic door? And through the floor. FBI profiler's office. You got a map with pictures connected with yarn and everything. Oh, no, no. You know there's a page in your books where you always say nice things about all the people that helped you out? The acknowledgments? Yeah. Well, <laughs> he wants to be acknowledged. Well, I, you know, I could be... Yeah, yeah, there are a few things you could do for me, actually. Really? 
Fame and money? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. The, the honest- She's like, oh, yeah, what, what an idiot. That- <laughs> getting something wrong means ruining people's lives. Good crime writing can set things right. So he made it big with that book and yep. made a lot of money. Probably got a nice advance. Sold a lot of copies. He watches his own interviews. What was that? Me watching my own interviews. Creep, you don't like it? Not really. Yeah. Didn't see the guy next to the tree. Mr. Boogie? Yeah. It's because he was in the tree. Let's see, he's behind that branch that fell. Is it him in the bushes behind the people? Yeah. Ooh, same get up. Yep, there, there he is. What does it mean? I do not know. It's a pretty good look at him. That's creepy, man. I got what you asked about. There was a Martinez family in Sacramento, California that died in their garage in 1979 and their car was set on fire. One of their sons, he was nine years old, they never found him. So he's killing the families and taking a kid. A kid. Just like I said. Wait, did you say 2976, like 2976? Yeah, why? Does that mean something to you? Before the Stevensons moved here, they lived where the Miller family murders happened. Holy. Whoa, did you see that? I'm looking at it. It's still. Wait a minute. That's him? Yeah. Is it him falling? Little goblin hands? Yeah, dude. Little goblin hands? I don't know. Did you see the little hands? Yeah, I did. What was that video? Him in the attic, getting ready to fall down, I guess. Fall through the thing. Ashley? What? What's going on? Oh, no, 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 no. That thing is playing. I hope his kid isn't watching it. Turn a light on, dude. Is there no lights that work in this house? Nobody has ever turned a freaking light on. Whoa. Dude's losing his mind or what, man? What? Oh, it's a skid. Dude. We have to put a lock on this door. It's way worse than it was. Oh, imagine that, man. You gotta lock your boy. You gotta lock your kid up in his room. Ugh. I would not want to do that. Lock my kid in his bedroom? That'd be terrible. Oh, he dropped his flashlight. Hmm? Uh-oh. Cujo. Hey, buddy. Good dog. Dude, you better grab that bat. I just want to get my bat. Yeah, man. Wow, those the missing kids? You keep it. Oh, see you later. Not interested. Dude, the bat is over here. Trevor's too old to still be having these. He was supposed to have outgrown them by now. It's because his dad's up all night watching creepy snuff films. Something that's eating you up and whatever it is, it seems to be getting to Trevor as well. I'm different because I've never been onto something this big before. I would tell you. Please. I wouldn't show you anything. I would totally tell you. I'm just worried about you. Well, don't be. I mean, I understand the sense, too, of, like, keeping you safe from it. Yeah, but clearly it's not working. I just need a little more time, okay? I promise it's worth it. I don't know. I'd say if you can get a house that nice without your wife working, just from writing, you've arrived. Thanks. No problem. Do you think I could come in for a second? Is this guy the killer? What? He's just weird and invasive. He's a fan! I'm not some local moron. Prove it, bro. Do you think these are serial murders? Maybe. Uh, they're so 100% serialized. They're being filmed and then <laughs> deposited it in your attic. I don't know. Look at the methodology. Cops don't even ask him where these photos or these still shots have come from. The only other significant link between the murder cases is that in each instance, the killer murdered the entire family except one. And they're all video recorded. Crime scenes. There's the car. That looks like something from out of the occult. You might want to call the university. There's a professor over there. He's an occult crime expert. So where do you think that drowning happened? That's what I need you to find out. You're in, bro. You're going to be on the acknowledgments. Lawn work 86. It's 
It's raining out. What the frick was it? What was it? What was it? I don't know what happened. What happened? It was a, a person tied up laying in the lawn. The lawnmower ran over him. <laughs> you scared me more than that scared me. So, lawn work. Yeah. So he ran over the family with a lawnmower? Dang, man. Professor Jonas? Yes. Thank you for getting back to me so quickly. This is the guy from uh, that uh, Stanley Kubrick movie. What the heck is it? Full Metal Jack. The symbol that you sent me is, isn't a pentagram. It's a symbol uh, associated with the worship of a pagan deity named Bagul, the eater of children. Eater of children. So you're saying the person that made this symbol is is eating children? Well, what what kind of benefit would you get from some, from something like that? Just randomly picking some pagan god or whatever that nobody's ever heard of and you just start killing kids for it? Yeah, man, dude. He's standing in front of the light so he can see absolutely nothing. Dude, you... How can you not, like, go to your son's room first? Hey, yeah, especially after what's already happened, huh? A couple times, yeah. Turn lights on, bro. Yeah. Although they say if it, there's an, an intruder in your house, you know your house better than right. anyone else, so you should keep the lights off. He doesn't, though. They just moved there. What? So these are ghost children, the ones who were sacrificed, I'm assuming. There's another one. He can't see them, just hears them. I don't know. What is their purpose exactly? Hmm. So, yeah, what is their purpose? I don't know. To creep, creep me out? Dude, that was the first thing you should have done. Oh my gosh. Oh! What just happened that he's freaking out like that now all of a sudden? I don't know. He senses something. He keeps hearing them running around. I don't know. Oh, my gosh. That was really upsetting seeing that little girl like that. Is something going to fly through that bay window? I don't know. Sure seems like it. Is there orange light right yeah, there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a fire? fire. Something's on fire, man. Or it's the sun coming out. Oh yeah, transition. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> We're just on edge, I guess. Look at that. Look at, look at what's that over there. Yeah. Why is this happening? <laughs> Was there anything weird about uh, the Stevensons? Mr. Oswald, is, is there something that you want to tell me? Yeah, crap's hitting the fan, bro. In my room because that used to be her brother's room. Who's Stephanie? She used to live here. She's the one Daddy's writing his book about. Busted. <laughs> oh. Ashley, go to your room and shut the door. Divorce time. That couldn't have been the worst possible way for her to find out. That was the worst possible yeah. way. <laughs> the previous owners of this home were hung from a tree in our backyard. I guess this is all worth it to you. What's worth it? Putting your family at risk. Take your children, pack a suitcase, and go. Am I going to stand by your man? Uh, I'll be in a hotel where I'm safe and my children are safe. There are plenty of other ways you can provide for this family. Doing what? Teaching? Uh, editing? Journalism? Textbooks? Hey, man. Honest, do what you gotta do. Honest living there. <laughs> Is he watching himself again on TV? I ever fall asleep watching myself on TV? <laughs> <laughs> Old videos of myself? Yeah. You definitely have permission to ask me what in the world is going <laughs> on. Oh, is he being video recorded? Oh my gosh. 
what is happening. Kids having a little slumber party yeah. movie night. Hmm. Whoa. <laughs> Sorry, but that was funny. Family are heavy sleepers. I was just going to say, so nobody hears this man scared to death screaming? Oh, man. I would I would just give that to the police, man. Yeah. I mean, there's somebody out there killing families. They need to be stopped. It's like a porn in the background. Do you hear that? Yeah, but it just sounds like chanting to me or something. Not me. What the hell are you doing? Oh, we my have goodness. to leave here. You think, bro? Get the kids. Pack the car. We have to leave. Dang. Go! Oh, boy. This sounds like a porno. Okay, get it. Move on. It's just inappropriate for the scene. Is this going to be the sheriff? Oh, yeah. Yep. Evening, Oswalds. Driving pretty fast for this time of the night, don't you think? It's because I pooped my pants back there at the mm -hmm. house. Just trying to take your advice, that's all. <laughs> Which advice would that be? Leave town and never look back. Now, you weren't bullied away or anything, were you? I don't want to be reading in your book that angry town folks chased you out of here. There ain't going to be no book, bro. There isn't going to be any book. He says that now. Give him a few months. Hold it under 60 till you cross the county line. Ma'am. Let's go home. Let's just get out of here alive, shall we? Whoa. That's the house they moved from. Look like a school. <laughs> it's huge. <laughs> yeah, it did. Oh, wow. Wow. You have arrived. They still don't know how to sh turn the lights on, though. Sorry it took so long to get back to you. Early Christians believed that Bagula actually lived in the images themselves and that they were gateways into his realm. If you destroyed the images with a fire, what, what, what would happen then? Mm, dang, he's serious. Right. Oh, no. Nope. No, dude, no, dude, no, dude. You think they're the same movies or uh, new ones? What was that little fit for? <laughs> so we can get to that. Extended, Extended cut. cut endings. Ew. Curiosity killed the cat, man. Deputy's got some. Yeah, come on. What's the problem? Okay, the problem is that you moved. Each family that you had me look up had previously lived in the house where one of the earlier murders took place. One of the earlier murders, so different houses, but... Put them in chronological order, you can actually draw a line from murder to murder to murder. And he went and lived in that freaking house where that family was. You just moved out of the last house in line. If, if this guy is still out there, you not only just sped up his timeline, you put yourself in it. Oh boy. So extended cut. What does that even mean? I don't know, but I bet you he's going to see himself laying in bed sleeping. Yeah, for sure. Oh. Oh, yep. Remember I said that? I was you wondering did. if it was the. Dang, that's grim. Stephanie. That's the little girl that his daughter saw. She had that big red bow. Yeah. I could do without this. It's a little he, cheesy. He's making the kids do it to their families. Somehow, yeah. I think his night terror kid is going to be in there going like this. 
Is not doing well. Hmm? Oh, did his daughter poison him? Oh my gosh, what, what, what? Oh my gosh. I like that you made the movies longer. Oh. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Oh. I'll make you famous again. What? I would have thought it would have been the boy. Maybe she was possessed that one night that she was laying in bed. Oh, is this a movie? Oh, wow. So now she's going to go missing. Now she's painted in the blood. Wow, Mr. Boy. Boogie. What? The head tilt. Oh, it's the lid to that box that's being all that all the what was that? What what, what was that? What was that? The face. Oh. Boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. That was a good movie. And if you tell me otherwise, you're no, lying. No, yeah. It was a good movie. I'll admit, you know me, I don't like the cheesy stuff. So this and the head tilting, the rest of it was just so like real life. But man, it doesn't matter. Uh still a great movie. Okay, guys, thanks a lot for joining us, and we'll see you next time on the Creepy Couch. Thanks.